for Gail Banks Creates. Welcome to my channel. I want to thank all of my existing and new subscribers. I appreciate all of your love and support that you've shown to me. Guys, today I'm on for my submission into hashtag Sat More Makes. This is an open collab hosted by uh, Jill Norwood, uh, who is uh, Greenwood Girl Cards here on YouTube. And there's a link in the description box to Jill's channel. But use that hashtag Sat More Makes to see all of the wonderful things uh, everyone in our crafty community has uh, created for this hashtag. Today, I'm sharing some Christmas tags that I made. But before we get into the tags, I'm going to just, you know what, I'm going to move them over here. So you guys know, so I can show you guys what I use to create these tags. Now, I use these ribbons. This is some Rick Rack ribbon I got from Hobby Lobby. And this is some ribbon I had in my stash from Michaels. I also used, oops, some of this gold and silver thread that I recently, oh, got it upside down, that I recently hauled from uh, Michaels. And... I use some of this Paper Studios twine. I use these two ephemera packs I had in my stash from Cartabella. This one is Winter Market. I use one from here and one from, what's the name of this one? Oops, hold on, I can't see it. My Favorite Winter. Ooh, the writing was so tiny I couldn't see it. So I use from there. I also use this Crafter's Companion die set. I mean, not die, uh, stamps. And these are the stamps that's in there. I use Merry Christmas and the uh, Happy Holidays stamp. I also use this Nelly's Choice tag frame dies. I got this off of HSN a while ago. This Sizzix uh, framelit uh, dies, uh, tag dies. And I use this size right here. That's what they look like on the back. So I use that size. And I use these shape dies I got from uh, scrapbook.com. I use that one right there. So here are my tags. Give you all a closer look at the tags. Here's the first one I created. And this here, I just used some bling out of my stash. And this is just that plaid paper pad from Recollections with Michaels. So I did the uh, snowflakes. And here, this cuts out and I just paper pieced it back in there um and then i took some tim hopes i think it was walnut stain or antique linen and went around the edge of the tag now i haven't put anything on the back yet but that's what i did there and this is just some craft card stock i had in my stash so that's that one here's this one that's that michael's plaid christmas pad some bling and I use silver foil. The gold foil and the silver foil was all from Recollections. And I took some, I know I used a Distress Oxide, but I can't remember the name of the color I used because I've already put it up, just to go around the edge of the Merry Christmas. And this paper, where did this paper? Um, I think it was some scrapbook.com paper. I'm not really sure. I don't. I put everything away, so I'm not sure. I put most of it away. Here's the smaller tag. And that's one of those Cartabella ephemera pieces. Here's the little Rick Rack. And these are just, here are little diamond dots I had in my stash that I put on there. And there's the twine. And last but not least, put up there, is this one. And like I said, just some diamond dots. And you know what? The paper pad I used, I believe it was for these two here was a Christmas paper pad from Hobby Lobby. And that's just the ribbon I used there. Okay? So, guys, that is my submission into hashtag Sat More Mates. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Hey, why don't you subscribe to the channel and hit the bell notification to be notified of new video uploads. Leave a comment below. I do respond to each and every one of my comments. I want you guys to take care of one another, continue to be safe, and I will definitely see you in the next one. Bye.